Okay, here I go with the final SS, SS timeless trial for this week. They're giving us that really annoying time lot where everyone gets a free revive. Which is so hard to deal with when the enemies are 10 levels over you. You gotta kill them twice. So if you don't have Omega with Ellerspo and Liana, I don't know how you're gonna do this. Because I think you have to kill Lambda on the first turn. Because she has an AoE that'll melt your entire team's face from across the map. And you don't want to lose all your lives to an AoE right away, so... I think you need to deal with Lambda on the first turn. So I think the second biggest threat on this map is Rachel, because she has Arcane Blast and Demolish, and those hurt a lot since she's 10 levels over you. Now what Sigma does is also really random. Sometimes he faction buffs, sometimes he kills Ludin on the first turn. I think faction buff might be the best one. So I can't use Cold Blood or I'll lose the bonus. Normally I use Landius as my tank, but Ledin is far better against him because of the Lancer advantage. Now Sigma is going to kill Ledin for the first time. ガマン Oh, she still lives. That's a big problem. So bad. Is he gonna kill Ledin? Probably. You know what, everybody has a revive at this point. So 
as long as they don't attack the same character and kill them twice, I should be okay. Double faction buff. が俺の力だ。何すりゃいいんだ。はい。ピーパー。はあ。絶望せよ。ごめんね。本当に。He's gonna die. Oh, Liana might live. Shrine maidens. So one thing is my Bozo is using Scepter of Divinity so he can attack from 3 range. I don't think it's completely necessary but it's a cool little toy that I picked up so I figured I should play with it. できれ。俺が俺の力だ。何すりゃいいんだ。はい。はあ。はい。人、思考、そして。もう我慢できれ。I'll show you my team here at the end. There's the Scepter of Divinity. Here's the MVP for Timeless Trial, Omega. Good luck, everybody.